Hi everyone, Electro here. What you're looking at is down the barrel of my gas processor. There's one half of it and there's the other half. Now, in my previous video, you may remember I was welding a stainless coil to a stainless plate. There it is there. And what happens is it goes around that S band. Now this will be the will go to the inlet of the engine, the inlet port, and there's another mesh grid there which is where the coil is connected to and that will make the electron extraction grid and electron extraction area well, that goes on the bottom of, of hang on a sec, I'll just turn the lights on now that will go on the bottom of there so when it's all connected up here it, that's the inlet side of it there, the, the tubes and everything will will go on the top there. Uh, that will go to the inlet port of the engine and the electron extraction circuit hooks up to there. Uh, all together, like I said, there's 200 LEDs here. Uh, the reason why I didn't finish was because I'm 7 short, so I'm going to have to source another 7 LEDs before I can finish this, but uh, I thought I had enough, but I didn't. Now, these are 700 nanometer, exactly these LEDs, and um, well, there's there's 200 of them there. Well, I'm close enough. There might be 193 or something like that, or 207 or whatever when it's complete. But it, basically, it's uh, two point or two point four volts say and it's drawing nearly five amps. But that's for the for all two hundred of them. So actually if you turn the voltage just down just a touch, you that varies quite a lot with very little difference in, in voltage. So you can vary hence you can vary the um the intensity quite easily just so that'll be something I'll be mucking around with but anyway that's where I am so far with this I'll keep you posted bye for now